What's going on guys? Welcome back to another free tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you exactly how these guys have made over $34,000 online. And what I want to do in this video is show you how to make money online doing the exact same method. Now, you're not going to need any money to get started with this particular method. And this is a brand new method to this channel. We actually haven't talked about this specific method before. We have talked about some of the AI software, but the method itself we have not talked about. So I'm gonna show you exactly how to make money with AI software step by step. I'm gonna take you through a few simple steps. We're gonna cover everything so you don't miss out on any information and you get all the information you need to go out and make this strategy work. Now another thing is you guys who watch my content are always asking for methods where you don't need to go and create a complicated website. You will not have to do this in this tutorial. You don't have to go create any websites, videos or anything like that because I do understand that sometimes those can be difficult for people to create so you don't need to do that in this tutorial now what can you expect from this video i'm going to show you exactly what you need to do every single step in a quick and easy 15 minute guide you will learn everything you need to know in this 15 minute tutorial so let's jump into this tutorial right now and i will show you how to make money online with ai software and show you exactly how those guys made over thirty thousand dollars all right guys let's get into this tutorial now as i said the goal of my tutorials is to do them as fast as possible but give you all of the information information that you need because I know you're very busy and you don't have time to sit down and watch a 30 minute video on YouTube. We all have short attention spans nowadays. So let's jump into this tutorial. What you're going to want to do is first go to a website called Allura and go ahead and create an account. You can do this for completely free. This is what you're going to use to do some research. The next step is what we're going to do is we're going to go to a website called Etsy.com. Now, if you don't know what Etsy is, it's a website where you can sell products online, jewelry, clothing, crafts, mainly crafts and things like that. And we're going to be using this to go ahead and make money online. So you first want to get Allura and then Etsy dot com make sure you have an account there and you want to have two ai tools that i'm going to show you in a second now what we're going to be doing in this video is we're going to be using ai to go ahead and create stickers and we could actually make money with these stickers without creating them ourselves we don't actually have to go and do any of the design work ourselves and i'm going to show you how to do everything step by step so if we actually scroll down here you can see some stickers and i'll show you how to get some sticker ideas in a second but these are some stickers people selling on etsy.com right now now one that stood out to me was this one here this jesus sticker that says i saw that it's a very simple sticker with a very simple set of words three words while well, I saw that. It's a very good sticker and it seems to be selling extremely well. So what I did is I clicked on this sticker and I went to their store. And what you can actually do is you can copy their store name and you can go to alura.io and you can go ahead and get a shop report. And what this shop report is going to do is going to show you their estimated sales and their revenue. Okay, well their sales and estimated revenue. And we can actually scroll down and we can see what one of their stickers is selling the best. And it's this meme sticker, fire, um, this fine meme sticker. And then this Jesus sticker is selling the most. And then they have a few more down here that are selling as well. But what you can actually do is you can use the Alura.io website to get free shop analysis on specific Etsy stores. And you can see exactly how much they're making from their particular products that they're selling. This is extremely helpful for when you're trying to go ahead and make money on Etsy. And as you can tell on page one, these are the two most popular stickers. Now you might be thinking to yourself, well, how can I go ahead and get some sticker ideas? What you can do is you can head over to um, your first AI software called ChatGPT. So go to openai.com and then get your own ChatGPT web uh, account, sorry. You can get a free version or a paid version, but I'm gonna go give me 10 sticker ideas to sell online. I have no idea what's going to come up here. I have, this is the first time I've ever did it, done it, but it should give us some ideas that we can use. All right, so ChatGPT has given me a few ideas. A lot of these are not really gonna be relevant 
But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go with animal ones because animal stuff always say, sells very well, especially back in the day when I used to do things like Teespring and stuff like that. It was basically always a win if you went with animal stuff. You have a very high chance of having a successful sticker. So for this example, we'll just go with cute animals. But there's all sorts of different types of sticker designs you can do. And you can even just go to um, Etsy if you like and go through and you can see the types of stickers that people are doing. So the next step, once you have your idea for your sticker, you're going to want to go and make the sticker. Now, what I did is I went and put in dog stickers into Etsy to just give me a general idea. Now, you see these ones here where it says personalized dog stickers. You can actually do that stuff with AI, which we'll talk about as well, where you can actually take someone's photo. And you can turn it into a cartoon, which might be a good way of doing it if you like. But anyway, there's all of these types of dog stickers, cat stickers, all sorts, right? So the possibilities are completely endless. So the next step is we need to actually go and create some type of dog sticker. And I'll explain to you exactly how to do that right now. All right, guys. So the next step is you want to go to a website called midjourney.com and you want to go ahead and click get started and sign in and create your account. And what's going to happen is you're going to be downloading a Discord. Inside this Discord, it's going to look like this. Where you can go ahead and you can put in prompts and you can create images. You can see all of these types of images people have been creating. Now, what I do actually is I have the paid version, so I can actually chat to this specific AI bot privately, so I don't have to scroll through all of this. Now, this isn't a full tutorial on how to use this specific chat bot. I have tutorials on that, but I wanna show you what I've been doing so you can see kind of the stickers that I've been creating. So if we go up to my direct messages here, um, and here we go, you can see that I have done a couple of stickers. Now, this is one of the stickers that I did was Cartoon GSP, German short um, nose pointer, which is a dog that I actually have right now, holding tennis ball and mouth sitting down. Now, these images are kind of all right. They're not that great. But what I did is we're going to use this one down here on the right as an example. So let me just do this again. It might even give us a different type of um, image. But what I do on the bottom is you go slash imagine and go prompt and then put it in. Now, this is a very basic um, command. Usually you could wanna be a bit more like, um, oh, oh, it just sent me a message on my phone. <laughs> I was wondering what that was, the mid journey did. Um, you wanna put in more advanced stuff, but as you can see, it looks like this image is going to be a little bit different from the original, which was up here. Actually looks pretty good. This one down the bottom looks a lot better than the, it's still, it's only 62% done. Here we go. Oh, that one looks really, really cool. And I kind of like the, the, um, that one. Anyway, I am going to use the original one that I used, but all you would do now is you would find the one that you like, let's say bottom left, and you go U4. So this is one, two, three, four, picture number four, and it's going to upscale it for you. So I'm going to show you how to do that and then save the image. Once that's done, we'll come back because it does take some time. All right, so as you can see, it's upscaled the image. Now, what I would do is click on this and go open in browser and then right click and go save image as, okay? And that's how you save your image. You can then go and sell it as a sticker. Now, the next step we want to do, I'm going to get rid of that real quick. Once you go ahead and create that image, you can find tutorials on how to use um, the Mid Journey bot. And you can actually turn images into cartoons. I'll explain to you exactly how to do that right now real quick. So what you do is you upload an image. I'll just upload this image right here and push enter. And then what you do is you get the link, open in browser and you get the link at the top, copy, go back to mid journey. You go into here and you put floored slash imagine. Okay. You post the, li the link and then you go space, make a cartoon. And it will turn that image into a cartoon. Now, you're gonna have to do different types of prompts because I tried it here and it didn't really work out. That's the images there. That, that one on the left actually looks quite cool. But yeah, and to be honest, this picture has too much going on. Like it's got a stick in there and, a, and the thing, if it was just a dog, we find. Anyway, we'll come back to this in a second. Now what you wanna do is you wanna go to um, canva.com forward slash stickers and what we can do is we can go and create custom stickers now don't worry we don't have to hold this in inventory or anything like that I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and do this without doing any of that 
But what you want to do is go to canva.com. I'll leave a link below so you can go and get yourself uh, onto this. And I'm going to go, uh, oh, we actually got our image. So let's have a look real quick. Yeah, so it's not very good at doing cartoons, but you have to do different types of prompts, but you can turn images into cartoons. Anyway, I'm going to go square stickers here. And we're going to use Canva to design some stickers. Start designing. Now, you don't actually have to do this. You can straight just use the image as a sticker. But the reason why I'm showing you this, let me just up uh, get an image on here real quick. So all you do is drag an image on. Okay. But I'll explain to you kind of why I want to do it like this, right? So this is a round outline sticker. Is we have so many other options that we can choose. We can actually choose different types of designs if we want. We can go ahead and add text. So I can go and add some text here that says, okay, so here's some text I just dragged Then I'm going to put GSP mum or something like that. So this could be like a bumper sticker um, or something like that. Now, I now keep in mind, this is just for this tutorial. But what I'm saying here is that you can actually use Canva to design different types of stickers. We can change the text size. You can use Canva to design these different types of stickers, right? You can put text in and stuff like that. So German short nose pointer mum. Like, you know what I mean? Like a, a mum who has a German short nose pointer, a mother, a, a human, not the actual dog. But as you can see, you can actually add different types of text. You can draw on the, on the sticker. You can add types of elements. So you can add like different types of pictures, elements. We could uh, go graphics, see all. There's different types of graphics we could add. Um, all sorts of things, right? So we could actually go ahead here. We could add like some steaks. You know what I mean? Like hungry dog or something like that. I think you get the point, right? So you can use Canva to go ahead and create stickers. Now, once you've gone ahead and created the sticker, you just go um, share and then we want to go download, okay? We're going to download this as a PNG, download. And it's gonna download. Let me just make sure it's all good here. Cool. So, now that's a pretty ugly sticker to be honest. I wouldn't sell this because of that meat there and like the wording. But let me go and show you uh, how you can actually go and upload this now to Etsy and make money. Now, keep in mind, this is just a tutorial you can go through. I just want to show you Canva so you can actually see what you could do. Now, if you didn't want to use Canva, you can go to a website called um, printful.com, which is what we're actually going to use to create these stickers. And you can actually just upload the image straight up without any text if you like. What you want to do is you want to go to the um, sticker section and you want to go to create product template now these are good these are the people that are actually going to create the stickers for you so you don't actually um i've already done one okay i'm just letting it do its thing but as you can see this is the website here that is going to actually create the stickers for you and send them out so you don't actually have to hold any stock this is print on demand and i'm going to go to continue and now what this has done is this has created the sticker in different sizes and i'm going to put gsp mum sticker just for this tutorial and then go save product template. Now I have that here and I can go add to store. And then what you can do is you can actually link all of this to your Etsy account. So if I go down to here, this is the print full website. And if we actually look at the bottom, so I'll explain to you kind of what it does real quick. Um, if you don't really know. So essentially what it does is they have products like bags, t-shirts, stickers, cups, phone holders. You put your own logo on and they send it out to the customer for you. You can actually link this all up to Etsy. So if we scroll down to the bottom, click on Etsy, you can link this up to your X, uh, Etsy account. And it says sell on Etsy with print on demand drop shipping. And then all you do is you go connect Etsy store. And what's going to happen is you log into your Printful account and you can go ahead and connect it to your Etsy store and it will upload that specific product for you. So then you can start selling it on Etsy. Very simple strategy and easy, so easy to do. It's so hands off. Now, the next thing is what you want to do is when you actually upload it to Etsy, it's going to take you to a screen. I'm not going to do it because I'm not logged in, but it's going to take you to a screen where you can actually go ahead and edit the details. And these are the types of details you're going to be able to edit. It's stuff like the title, the description, 
the highlights and things like that. So when you actually go and upload this specific product with your stickers to Etsy, you wanna make sure in the title you have keywords. Like they've got Corgi sticker set, cute Corgi sticker, cute stickers, cute dog stickers, funny stickers, gift for her, pet stickers. These are all keywords that are gonna come up when people search those specific words. So that's what you wanna have in the title is keywords. That's the most important part when optimizing your listing for Etsy. And then down here, you also wanna have specific keywords in the description. It's not as important. Etsy actually puts most of the weight in the title but try and spread a few keywords out in here. So like for example, where it says each set includes eight stickers, I would have said each set includes eight pet stickers or eight dog stickers. All right guys, so that's how you can go ahead and make money online right now with Etsy stickers and AI software. Don't forget to subscribe, tap that notification bell, hit that like button, and I'll see you in the next video.